Welcome back to Most Buffalo. April's Autism Awareness Month and the YMCA Buffalo Niagara is helping kids with autism through some of their summer programs. It offers summer camp, adaptive swim lessons, before and after school child care, and so much more. And joining me live in studio is Vice President of Education and Child Care Services, Brenna Lupo. Again, Brenna, we know summer is right around the corner. Many parents are starting to look for those camps, or they're probably in the midst of this right now to keep their kids busy. So why do you think that the programs at the Y are a good fit for families who have children with autism? Yeah, so we have make, made quite a concerted effort to include all families, including those with diverse abilities or neurodiverse kiddos. Um, we employ lots of different facets to make sure all of those kids are included in all of our programming. So it's not necessarily programming specifically for children with autism, but it's programming that's beneficial to them. Correct, we wanna, we wanna include them in what we're doing and make them feel a part of our Y community. And what are some of those programs? So we have summer camp where we uh, employ inclusion specialists whose sole job during the summer is to make sure kids are included. Um, we have summer camp from Luport all the way on down to our South Towns locations. Um, we partner with the Special Olympics at several of our locations to offer the Young Athletes Program, and that's for neurotypical kiddos and kiddos with intellectual and diverse abilities. Um, and we also have adaptive swim lessons. So we, we run the gambit for those kiddos. What are those like, the adaptive swim lessons? So my son has actually, hi Jackson. <laughs> um, my son has actually been a part of those and it is the most wonderful thing. Our instructors are especially trained to work with kiddos with diverse abilities or kids who are on the spectrum. Um, and they go over water safety and swimming mechanics and fun, but most importantly, safety around the water. And those are indoor, outdoor? Um, they are indoor, um, but couple, a couple of our summer camps do have outdoor swimming pools where the kids receive swim lessons during summer camp. And you also mentioned the Special Olympics programming, and that's yeah. free. That is free. That is a partnership with um, Special Olympics um, for kiddos ages two to seven um, at several of our locations. That's gonna be launching June 8th. So registration will be opening soon for that. And that's for kids and siblings or friends who have intellectual or developmental disabilities as well as neurotypical kids. And you mentioned you're an autism mom yourself and I'm sure that kids can have access to so many um, resources during the school year, but then during the summer it is kind of a gap, right? So that's a concern. Absolutely. Um, the summertime is a gap. That's why we have put so many resources into making sure those kiddos are included. And like you mentioned, you're in pretty much every single community. So mm -hmm. how can people sign up? Registration is still open for most of this? Registration is still open. Space is limited. Um, YMCABN.org. All right, perfect. Brenna Lupo, Vice President of Education and Child Care Services at the Y. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you and, for having us. And, uh, and marking Autism Awareness Month this month. We appreciate it.